Discovery. This is Nick Farrow, and this lesson will be about negative sentences. It's a review of the videos we did before, and it's quite short. We're looking at three kinds of sentence, three verb types. The first is the verb to be, which has the pattern of be plus not. For example, I'm not ready, or they aren't engineers. Next is the pattern with a helping verb, such as can or will or would, and a general verb. Take, walk, imagine. These are the main verbs we use. For example, we could say, I cannot imagine living on a ship. The third type is also a general verb, but it has no helping verb in a regular sentence. In the negative form, we add the helping verb do. For example, they do not live here. Or, in natural conversation, they don't live here. Let's look at some examples to see how these work in reality. Again, the blue sentences have the verb to be, the green sentences have helping verbs, and the red sentences have simple past and simple present general verbs only. Notice that these verbs, am, were, and is, are simple be verbs. But in these two cases, they are helping verbs for the main verbs wait and check. And this is the same here too. Have, in this case, is a general verb, but here it's a helping verb. In that rather strange sentence, she has eaten a frog. Let's see how these change in the negative form. First, we will change the blue and green sentence. The main point here is that in these cases, we need to put not after the first verb in every case. When we change the simple present and simple past tenses to the negative, like this, we need to add the do helping verb. And again, the pattern is the same. Now, we need to check some other changes that happen in these simple sentences. The first example, she drove a truck, changes to she did not drive a truck. Be careful not to make it a double past tense. This example is the same, removed, changes to remove. And in the last case, Tina likes sushi. Be careful to remove the S. Tina doesn't like sushi. Here are the same sentences in the shortened natural speaking form. I'm not intelligent. They weren't very kind to me, etc. Please check through them and notice that in this example, Jenny's not at home, you can also say Jenny isn't at home. The next one could be they're not waiting. And one more, Ted's not checking his emails. The meanings are exactly the same. It's only a style change, and you can say whichever is easier for you.
also they might not come home is easier said that way, although some people might say they mightn't come home. I don't think that's so natural. I think they might not come home is easy to say. There are some more changes in some cases in negative sentences. Look at these. These are the normal sentences, but they change. The first one, I have some money, changes to I don't have any money. The next two, you can see the expression a lot of, which is normal in regular sentences. In these cases, they will change. She doesn't have many friends. We don't want to drink much wine. Next one, a little more complicated. She still thinks about you. Changes to, she doesn't think about you anymore. That is perhaps the most natural way to make that change. And finally, they have already arrived. Becomes, they haven't arrived yet. Or perhaps they haven't yet arrived. So, when you are writing and speaking, you have to remember a lot of points, all at the same time. When you are reading, it's good to try to notice these points. Then you will be more conscious about them when you are speaking and writing. Let's practice some of these points now. Practice helps very much to make you ready to speak and write correctly. Please look at these sentences and put the negative form of the be verb in the spaces. It's best to pause the video so that you have time to change the sentences in your mind, or if you want, you can write them on paper, then I'll give the answers. Okay, here are the answers. I am not sleepy. My friends are not at home. Tokyo is not in Korea. Picasso isn't Japanese. Or perhaps Picasso wasn't Japanese. Yesterday I was not happy. I wasn't happy. In 2008 my parents were not in America. Next one. Now you need to do the same thing with sentences with the helping verbs. There are no spaces in these sentences, so you must choose where to write the word not. Again, pause the video. And now I'll give you the answers. I'll give you the correct forms. Number one, you must not eat in class. Next, I cannot jump three meters. Terry and Bill are not going home. John could not finish his report yesterday. Sorry, we cannot come to your party. Sam hasn't eaten breakfast yet. A few more to practice now. Now we have examples of sentences with general verbs. Simple present and simple past tense. 
They have no helping verbs, so you will put in the do helping verb in the right place, plus not, of course. Be careful of any extra changes you may need to make. OK, try them. And here are the answers. I do not drink whiskey. I don't drink whiskey. Sometimes I don't wash my hands before eating. Usually, my mother doesn't make lunch for me. Most English people do not like natto. Most English people don't like natto. I don't have any money. This is important. I have not money is not natural English. I don't have any money is correct. Yesterday, I didn't go to work. And finally, the teacher didn't come to school yesterday. One final practice exercise. These ones are mixed, all three types. One point, be careful in the last sentence. Don't make this part of the sentence negative or it will have a strange meaning. Now, here are the best ways to make the sentences negative. I don't speak Russian. You could also say, I can't speak Russian, which has almost the same meaning. I am not as old as the teacher. My friends don't live in Beijing. Lim's father doesn't work in an office. I don't have two boyfriends. I'm not sleeping right now. Tomorrow, Ken won't take the test because he isn't ready. Last one. I didn't finish the homework because I was tired. That's all. I hope it was a useful lesson. Please like it if you liked it and subscribe for more videos too. Don't worry about your grammar if it isn't perfect. We are working to help you make your grammar better so that your communication will become clear and beautiful. If you want to write a comment, please do. Don't be shy. I believe you learn more by trying to speak and write than only by listening to teachers. I'll talk to you again soon.